Subscribe to our YouTube Club 520. Uh, we clowning on that mother. Just hit the button. <laughs> God. Don't ask more questions. Subscribe. <laughs> the future album drop. This is just excited for a future album. But we didn't know we was about to get all this, bro. Mm. We didn't know we was about to get all this. Before we even get to that, y'all the album? I do. I f hey. Metro! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Metro production is crazy on every single song. No. You don't even got to listen to what Future talking about. In the whip, that laps. Mm -hmm. But the first song I heard was like that. And I was like, damn, Kendrick Lamar really don't give a fuck about these niggas. And I love it. The first thing I thought of was like, whose side is B here and all? Mm. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm Future Hendrix to the death. But mm. I just feel like Kendrick kill shit. Don't get it fucked up. He did, but I just think like... He can't, like my niggas was saying in our family chat, like he can't come out, drop some shit, and then be on the shit he be on on his regular album. Like, lace us with that pause, and then come out with a good kid, Mad City type album. No. Like the, the, he ain't the, on that. Yeah, but you are, though. You are, though. You coming out talking shit, you hopped on a crazy beat. <laughs> you went nuts. You we never thought we would hear Kirsten Lamar on a fucking Metro Boom. Yeah, beat. like... Because I'm like, you can't say really you the best and you ain't coming out like them. But I can say I'm the best because I know if I say something about y'all, y'all ain't going to say nothing back. They would. Uh, I'm saying I'm the best because I know y'all can't rap better than me. So Kendrick raps better than J. Cole. Like mm. bars? He don't make better music than nah, Drake, he, but I like J. Cole music better, but if you just say rap. Rapping. Kendrick Lamar probably rap better than J. Cole. Like, okay. like a battle rap? Oof. Like on this, on the type of time he on now, do yeah. y'all think either one of them motherfuckers can come back? Yeah. Nah, anytime I think Cole can for sure. Anytime Kendrick do a battle rap, he like kill everybody. Like nobody ever respond. Like what yeah. was the other song he went crazy on? Oh um, yeah, control. Yeah, like nobody ever yeah, said. Yeah. Hey, shout out to my nigga Big Crib, but Crit he just killed it. he just he did he just clocked like, out of Amazon. Nah, Chris still Just going. Just got my nigga, man. Fuck with Big Crit, bro. Chris still going, bro. Matter of fact, I'm about to listen to Big Crit when Lee here. Crit got slaps. Nah, I, can't, I just think Kendrick got to give us a give us an album, bro. Give us an album. But also, I agree to that point, but my counter to that is, I can't get mad at him if he say that to these niggas and they don't write back at him. All right, then I'm going back to do my RC shit because y'all clearly don't want yeah. smoke. So, I gave y'all a chance. Niggas so, niggas, they want got, it. niggas got a certain time to respond, but oh, it ain't respected. They on the clock right no, now. It's on the clock. Yeah, they on the clock. Damn, y'all doing the right, bro. Yeah, yeah, bro. They on the clock. Cole. I don't care if you're on tour, bro. I don't care. <laughs> and y'all on tour together. Cole ain't on the tour no more. Nah, uh, he's definitely on tour because he, he, he prepared he for his tour. He done now. Oh, uh, he off? Wayne oh. is supposed to be doing his spot dates and then Dirk is too. That tour is kind of weird too that people don't talk about. That wasn't really a full tour. J. Cole was supposed to do a majority of that tour and he's done like every couple of them bitches. But he got Dreamville Fest next week, so. yeah. Damn, so, that's his next week? I was yeah. supposed to go. I thought he was going to drop his album before it, too. I really thought the Cole was going to drop an album for it. Because that little snippet that he been dropping, yeah. he been talking shit. So yeah. I'm sure nigga saw that. He probably had to go back to the left. Oh, oh we got we need one more song. <laughs> this nigga got fucked up. <laughs> See, how, he going to respond. How do y'all rank them, though? Them three. Ooh. As we just saying, rapping? Or you saying, like, artists? Like, oh. I mean, you know, everybody's going to Drake. The charts, all that shit. I'm just saying, like, rapping. Uh, is Drake last on that list? Yeah, when, for sure. When they talking about just straight rapping. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Last one. Now, okay. I think the one thing that people don't like acknowledging is that, and I from the Joe Budden podcast broken down, like, the perfect way I've ever thought it and then said out loud. Drake being the biggest star is something that people have to respect because being a star is something that actually takes time and energy. To shit. It is a talent. As much as people don't want to acknowledge it, like LeBron being a star is a fucking talent. You can't knock that. You have to do what it takes to be on that pedal, on pedestal. I know sometimes it's corny, sometimes it's cliche, and we don't like it, but it does take an amount of talent to be able to do that. Everybody don't have that shit. But when it comes to them three rapping, yeah, Drake is last, mm. for sure. I was just saying, because Drake, Drake shit, when he did that to Meek Mill, was like legendary. Yeah, bro. Oh, yeah, he, I don't he, know if either one of them got some shit like that. Because that shit was being played in the but club. He, he can't do that to them. He can't. It's different bars and different levels. You can't do that. He can't do that to Kendrick. He didn't know it was Pusha T. Yeah, you can't, you can't do that. Nah. <laughs> can't do that. You know what I'm interested about? Because I feel like <clears throat> regardless of if Drake responds back to Kendrick, 
he got to respond back to Future. And that's one thing that people keep missing in this whole situation. They threw him a crazy lob to go at him on that. Yeah. So it's about a girl. It's if it's always about money or a girl. So who are, who y'all think is out of pocket? Who y'all think started being song, petty? On the first song, Future, you could kind of hear him talking about it. Like he say, like you, something about a friend. No, it's yeah, it's all over you. I'm just yeah. saying, who y'all think started being petty first between Future and Drake? Come on, man, you know who you probably, think was tripping off because both of them know, probably, probably tender. Drake, it was though. probably Drake, bro. <clears throat> if history, <laughs> y'all go give it to Drake. If, if history future, shows, it's probably Drake. Future that scraped one of mine. One of, you know what I mean? It took her up top. So, what am I? Uh, you know my previous relationships before I was. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So I don't know how Shout you out the game. <laughs> Just say it. It happened. We don't trust you. We don't. <laughs> it happened. So I, I know he a shooter. Who's then, right? Oh, he's Steph Curry. Yeah. Then Drake. DC Drake sniper. is a sniper, yeah, though, he, y'all. Yeah, That's what the, I'm saying. But he it's... out the trunk with it. <laughs> Boy, like. Future walk. Future, he, he, you know, he broad daylight. No, nah, for yeah. sure. No well, man. Drake is dark, known for dirty macking. Like, we don't yeah. have to act like we... He's known for dirty macking. Yeah. But yeah. I, I feel like that Metro and Drake situation was kind of probably the biggest issue with that. And Feature seen both hands. I mean, both sides of both hands would happen. So I wouldn't be surprised if there's more to that Drake Metro beef. Because they was going at it for a little minute. They little yeah. shit online and stuff. And we didn't know what it was about. But also, we hadn't seen Future and Drake do songs. And Drake been making music. Shout out my nigga 21 Savage, too, man. He in the middle of all this dumb shit. I hate I think, that. I think he took advantage of it. He really got to pick us up. <laughs> no, he don't. He took advantage of a great opportunity. Thanks. Oh, y'all niggas like get along? You going to do this album with me, nigga? It's in, oh, cool. Come on. Yeah. I ain't tripping. Run it up. I ain't got yeah. shit to do with this. Metro, my nigga, anyway. Yeah, facts. Yeah. I would just love to see the core. I hate messy shit, but I always just want to know, like, who really got shit cracking? Like, this Who's bitch really ass nigga. Hit my bitch. Crazy. That's funny. But pillow talking, if y'all hitting the same chick, is crazy. Especially the niggas of that type of statue, it's going to get said. Hitting the same chick when you, them two, it's crazy to me. But I just think it's like. She got to feel great. No, nah, for sure. But I'm saying on the entertainment <laughs> side, I think I think they only have a select few for real, bro. It's no. only certain girls that get in the clubs and around. No. Niggas yeah. don't have access to. You ever been on Instagram? I know that, bro, but it's like when that girl, say Drake bring that girl to the party and future there, whoever there, it's a fat party. Motherfucker, like she might be the hardest thing in there. Niggas is shooting their shot, bro. I heard a, a lot song. of these girls what getting bodies. Say, I got 60 naked bitches. No exaggeration. Go, go, boy. <laughs> I believe. <laughs> Come on, bro. Yeah, no, bro. It's, it's too many. Hey, and Drake, it, Drake it and girls, everybody talk about your body is T. Yeah. <laughs> Man. <laughs> That's a crazy I'm deal. I'm with on this one. Yeah, he said That's a wild it. deal. That's a sick deal. I don't take up a drink, but get off my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Your body is T is crazy. <laughs> That's a wild <laughs> shot. I don't even know what she's supposed to say after that. But I'm saying, though, bro, it ain't really be slim pickings, bro. Nah, no, no, it's not, that's bro. Crazy. <laughs> but niggas make it slim pickings. I'm saying, you got to think, that's why niggas be having the same baby mama. Nah. Like I was reading, I was listening to Mason. Them it's more like people be fans. Like if you being for real, like, yeah. Damn, that's old buddy girl. I'm about to snipe old buddy girl. Yeah, that's how that be. Happening. It's more efficient to see for sure. I'm saying who they want to choose. It's like damn, she fuck with him. Let me shoot my shot too. Yeah, it's, it's more of that. Like oh, that's old buddy girl. I'm gonna grab her because you gotta think about all the girls in the world, bro. Man, and they the most famous people in the world. They can have... No, they can have anything body. they want, but it's like... I don't know, bro. I just be thinking it'd be the and same girls them everywhere, bro. You can build one. Mm. Start real, all you real. gotta do is go catch a... You can go wherever you want in the countries. Find you a pretty girl and you can... Definitely build a bird machine. <laughs> I was waiting for you to say. I'll try to throw you the lie. <laughs> nah, for was, sure. I was anybody, waiting for you to Any, go. Anybody, anybody. Anytime you throw a lie, you got to say Metro now. Anybody metro. under the right metrics can be thrown through the Amazon machine, <laughs> for sure. But what I'm saying is, I don't think niggas is out here. It's like, what's available right now? You want to build up who you got on the took. 
But you gotta have your, your scout team. Kid. You gotta have your scout team. Your scout team to the T, bro. Your assistant coaches. That's when they step in, bro. Metro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, assistant coaches are important. <laughs> Very important, bro. They're Part there the for the day to day. Part of the game. <laughs> nah, I just think girls run in packs, though, for real, bro. They do. They run in packs, bro. Y'all yeah, see the same girls, bro. You gonna see the same girls in every city for the most part, bro. That's how I look at it. It be a bunch of bad bitches in the concerts, but niggas ain't looking in the nosebleed. <laughs> bitches up there touching the jerseys. You ain't really looking. Man, you listen. got a hell of a eye if you up there. <laughs> listen, man. They got they got Instagram. It ain't they they can touch. Okay. I respect it. The Ooh, shit. Niggas. <laughs> Metro. <laughs> That D Wade, <laughs> LeBron, Oak, when they got feature in Metro now, is even better now. Yeah, that's hard. Oh, that's hard. That's hard. I'm just laughing because they did the Rolling Loud set, and Travis Scott was like, "Hey, play that shit. Play that." Travis Scott, he, he with the he shit. He knew. <laughs> he with the shit. <laughs> he knew. Yeah. And right. then niggas was just like, "I didn't know that Kendrick verse was on there." All right, everybody's lying. Did he pick a side then, Travis? Because I thought he fucked with Drake. Oh, uh, Travis picked a side. Oh, so he would Metro. Yeah, he picked a side. <laughs> he so, definitely picked a side. So you with Future? All day. Yeah, well, it's not, it and this one, call my nigga, but I'm rolling with Future on this. Call, Damn, gotta do so y'all, y'all with John ja Morant. John ja Morant added himself to this conversation. <laughs> he ain't got shit to do right now. <laughs> Shout out to John. Ja. John's ja the real future. You can't wait to get into this shit. <laughs> my nigga's the real future hitcher. <laughs> Better leave. The real AAU team is on the way. <laughs> Let's go 12. <laughs> <laughs> no Mike Daddy for sure <laughs> <laughs> and y'all yeah. know Mike Daddy's the feds so listen shout out to Big Mike back <laughs> let him do you like that OG <laughs> Metro, that's my nigga lock Jeff Cousin up oh god allegedly <laughs> put my man behind bars now we fired with the lineage <laughs> <laughs> free cuz snitching that seed over there oh my god <laughs> wow <laughs> Hey man, Mike been cooking all morning. Leave my nigga alone, man. Come back. I'm really coming here smelling like this. Came here like White Castles, nigga. We both said, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs>